Right. Greetings and salutations and welcome back to Ultima 7 The Black Gate. So, um, last week we did have a... Oops, let me just get back to the menu. Last week we did have a stream, but uh, it didn't really work out. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. It was a bit late and it ran, well, that is to say it was started a bit late. And I later discovered that um, a large portion of it hadn't been streaming for some reason, or rather there was audio but no video. Or at least there was audio of me, I'm not sure whether there was audio of the game. Uh, at any rate, so, and not much was actually achieved. We, uh, we looked up the uh, solution for the dungeon to find out where we were supposed to go and uh, discovered that we weren't in a good position to actually do it, especially because we were out of food. So, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, so, what we're going to do is we're going to journey onward and we're going to uh, try to pick up more or less from there. So we're in Dungeon Deceit. Um, we are starving. I'm just going to see if maybe I have a morsel somewhere. Uh, that's not a morsel. Ah, good. Okay, so I have something I can stave off starvation at least. Uh, just going to... There we go. And uh, indeed, that is one of the things that we really want to get, pick up in this session is... Uh, come on, no one die, no one die. There we go. I really want to pick up food, lots and lots of food. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry if you hear me coughing a little bit. Okay, so... Having done that, I'm going to just put a quick save down here since we got through all of that without dying. And uh, I'm going to head south to Moonglow and see what food we can get our hands on there, I think. Uh, speaking of which, where precisely do we want to go? So we're there. Okay, if we just head straight south, we should more or less hit what I think was the Lyceum. So yes, yeah, so the main... Um, thrust of this uh, this particular stream is going to be preparing for Dungeon Deceit um, and depending on, oh, oh we just hit the Lyceum and depending on how that goes uh, maybe tackling Dungeon Deceit again itself um, what is this place um, one of the things that we discovered is that uh, the dungeon is no, I can't look at it from here. Uh, the dungeon is well protected, uh, or at least the, the generator that we're trying to uh, reach is well protected by a terrible ethereal beast. Uh, not quite sure what that says offhand. Ah, this is the healer. Okay, this isn't really where we want to be. That's fine though. Um, which we're not really in a position to defeat right now. Um, to which end, uh, yes, I know, I know, uh, I'm going to try to find food people, don't worry. I don't know where, what creatures are food people, but uh, I suppose something's a food person. Maybe gremlins are food people since they drop food. Um, what was I talking about? Uh, oh, sorry, 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 you're right, I probably shouldn't be in here, this is your house and all of that. All right, there, they're opening. Um, I've forgotten what I was talking about. Also, I might be a little bit, uh, I might be a little bit out of it today, I am very, very tired and a little bit out of it, so... Um, Please excuse me for that, if called for. Uh, I, yeah. Uh, so yes, if I'm a little bit uh, easily, I'm get, I was going to say a little bit easily distracted, but maybe rather a little bit more easily distracted would be uh, 
accurate. What is is this? What is this place? Ah, excellent. Hi, um, Yolo. How much gold? Oh dear. Ah, this could be a problem. So we have no gold and no food. Um. Hmm. This could be a problem. I'm just going to see if we have anything saleable lying around the place somewhere. Uh, because if not, uh, I suppose the only thing that's really all that feasible is to go go hunting. Um, oh, we don't need that to be burning. <laughs> And we can't eat Katrina's hawk. I am both glad and sorry to say, I suppose. What's that? Oh, that's the ethereal ring, isn't it? Yeah, we do want to hang on to that. Um, that's terribly useful. And we do have one gold nugget. Okay, so we have a gold nugget that we could take to we could take to uh, Britain, but that's not going to help us very much. So we are yeah, kind of desperate for food. Joy. Uh, let's hope there's some game or maybe some gremlins around the place. Something we could use as a food source. Uh, actually, wait. Uh, do we have a fishing rod? I don't think I saw one, unfortunately. Um, maybe that's something I should rectify given the next opportunity. So we could really use a way of gathering food when we don't have it. Um, I'm thinking maybe I should be heading back to the mainland. Might be uh, more likely to find game there. Hmm. Okay, in that case, I'm going to reload, in fact, just to be on the safe side. I don't know how long I have um, before they start dying. So, let's plan this out. So. Moonglow is not much good for us. We don't have money with which to buy food, unfortunately. Um, Vespa here, I don't recall having much useful game. There was game to be had. Where did I find it? Yes, hereabouts, this sort of area. I don't know whether there's anything here, but it looks like a place that might have game. And it's an awful lot closer. Um, there are sheep down here on New Magincia, but they're not our sheep. Um, there's also whatever's here, maybe, so I think yes, let's head, head west, oh, hold on, well, this is Dagral, this, none of this stuff belongs to anyone, surely, so there's a food source right there, hi guys, sorry about this. Can we get milk from you? We can moo at you. Uh, all right, uh, everyone, steak tartare it is, I suppose. Um, let's see. I'm not sure I can really see everyone. Okay. Now, I don't know who's hungry. That's the next question. Oops, not what I was trying to pick up. Okay, so I'm fine. Yolo's fine. Sparks hungry. Dupre's hungry. Sentry's hungry. Okay, so Spark, Sentry, and Dupre. We want to. Oops. We want to feed. Uh, now let's see. So I did see Spark. I think that's Dupre there. And, uh, oh no, that's Dupre, right? That was Sentry that I just fed then. Okay, good. 
Yes, okay, so no one is actively hungry right now. So the rest of this is, uh, is profit, so to speak, is uh, a contribution to uh, restoring our, um, our uh, well, our stores. Uh, where's that other one? There we go. Glad that you get quite a bit of meat off of one of these cows, which, I mean, makes sense. Should probably technically get even more than that. Just going to save that result, since that was quite a good find. Is there anything else living here that we can, you know, kill and eat? <laughs> Greetings, Dinah, and uh, thank you. I'm glad that you're enjoying my... Uh, Adventures in, um, what's it, uh, in starvation. Uh, Ultima is, uh, can't get a coconut, can I? No. Uh, you're wondering why I didn't do the opposite and go bre bake bread. Well, I don't have any uh, flour or water. Plus, um, I didn't know how long I had before someone starved. And, uh, yeah. Um, plus, I mean, do I, do I look like YOLO tomorrow? I mean, you don't know what I look like, most likely, so you can't actually answer that. But, uh, hypothetically, you know, rhetorically speaking, oh, hey, here's another cave. Rhetor rhetorically speaking here, oh, it's this one, okay, yes, I've been in here. Um... So, I suppose the next thing to do... Next thing to do is to try to figure out which way it is back to my uh, magic carpet because I'm a trifle lost. Are you a dog? Oh, you're a dog. Good doggy. Uh, I don't know why there's one lone dog on this aisle. And of course someone's... Oh, whoops, I've used up a torch, unfortunately. Uh, Yana, hi. Um... do. Uh, now where did I leave that, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, that magic carpet? Ah, there we are. Right, so I was going to go uh, go west. Um, life is peaceful there, I believe. Let's see if I can find any game on the mainland that I can kill. <laughs> this looking like a, a reasonable sort of biome um, in which to find game. Clearly, this is uh, clearly Ultima Seven is an early uh, an early antecedent of Minecraft and other such survival games. Uh, well, is it? It's at a keg, that's not really what I'm looking for. Okay, not finding anything terribly useful here. I also don't remember where I left my ship. Um, the ship is somewhere and has some quite useful stores in it. Um, I, oh, hey, what's that? Ooh, nice. Oh, hi. Uh, there's a lich. I didn't know there were two liches in this game. Uh, what has been done to this person? Yana is something, something, and something. Oh, I think that's protection. Not quite sure. Uh, all right, let's... Yeah, no, we probably can't land here safely because there's a lich over there. Could be par paralysis. Yes, indeed, uh, indeed, Dino. Uh, hello? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. That's why I'm not going into combat mode. Okay, let's see if we can take on a lich. Why not? Uh, where is the lich? Uh, lich? Oh, there you are. No? Thought I saw the lich. Hmm. I uh, don't know whether we actually killed that lich or whether they just despawned. 
especially as I thought I saw something here. We were flying past. Um, just get a bit of light here. Uh, where is my spell book? Uh, oops. Ah. No sign of a lich now. Uh, where are we precisely? Okay, so we're more or less in the middle. I'm actually going to come back and try that again. Um, so I feel like that lich might have despawned or something. Um, yeah. Now I want to have a proper shot at that. Um, Sentry, you care to join us? I know we're going to fight a terrible undead horror, but uh, thank you. So, let's see. We are here. So I want to go west and a little bit north. See how we're doing. About northwest from here, I think. Hello, Scorpion. You're not actually of interest to me right now. But fine. Oops, wrong button. We will kill the scorpions. Yeah, scorpions don't drop anything, unfortunately. So this looks like. The, oh, go away, Scorpion. I'm not here for you. This looks like it might be the Oasis. And uh, let's see what we find here now. Oh, yeah, this looks more like it. And there's a body and all sorts of interesting stuff going on here. Nice. Your memory's hazy, but could that have been the place in the Shrine of Sacrifice? Uh, could be. Um... Let me think about that. Shrine of Sacrifice. Sacrifice is associated with the Tinkers, as I recall, who, yeah, are usually associated with Minoc in this sort of area. So, could well be the Shrine of Sacrifice. Oh, you just checked and it is. Yeah, there you go. Uh, unfortunately, someone died here. Um, the Great Dagger. Hmm. I wonder whether that's any good. Um, I'm just going to go and check that. Um, Head over to the uh, Ultima Codex. And uh, let's see now. Oh, yes. Uh, weapons, weapon, whoops. Weapon values, that's the one that I want. Uh, let's see. Uh, it's a great knife, apparently. Which, I mean, they, they claim that it's particularly good, but. Uh, oh, pardon me in the name there, but uh, that doesn't mean it genuinely is. Um, great Dagger. Uh, so that does five damage, which for a dagger is respectable. Um, the range of four. But I think that, yeah, and everything else is just better than it, is the thing. Um, hmm. Okay, so, I mean, that's... Cool, I, I like it. Um, but uh, hold on, oh, the lich, hi, you're still here, go away. What am I stuck on? There we go. Ah, the lich being a pain even in proper death. There we go. Okay, so that is the lich's inventory. Yeah, nothing there. None of these guys have anything on them. Who's okay, you're poisoned, but you still have plenty of hits, that's fine then. Uh hmm. Okay, well nothing much actually happened here, but uh that was a neat little encounter. 
There isn't anything hidden around here somewhere, is there? Just feeling a little disappointed. There's a epic encounter with a lich. Well, maybe not epic, but a, a cool encounter with a lich. There's um, a sacrificial shrine. And nothing actually comes of it. But, oh well, so it goes. Now I just have to uh, find my um, carpet again. There we go. Hello, scorpion. Goodbye, scorpion. Scorpions, apparently. Okay, so... Um, just save, because we did do something there. And uh, let's see... So we didn't find any game here. Let's try heading north and a little west and see if we can find... Um, actually, I wonder whether I shouldn't... Oops. Whether I shouldn't see if I have a cure spell for him. Well, you'll just have to be happy with role-playing... With, with the role-playing warm feeling of having liberated a shrine and continue starving. Yes, I will. <laughs> Indeed, I'll just have to uh, role-play that I feel that I have done my duty for the world. I have cleansed it of a great evil. Uh, now, do I have a cure poison spell? I do, good. Uh, and uh, you're poisoned, and is someone else poisoned? Yana's poisoned too. Okay. I'm going to have to go... Um, Oops. I'm going to have to go looking for uh, reagents one of these days. But I'll need money for that. Uh, bandits. Well, oh, and they've killed something. Okay. Uh, anything of interest? Ooh, money. We could use that. Um, yeah, there we go. What's this? A blowgun. I wonder whether that's any good. Uh, let's have a look. Weapon values. Blowgun. Okay. Oops. Uh, page jumped. There we go. Needs no ammunition, chance to sleep or poison, but only has one damage. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, locked. All right. Well, I'll just get out. I'll have to get out my universal lock picks then. Uh, let's see. Is that you say? You've gone straight past the lock picks? No, I haven't. Here's my lock pick. You can't see it, but I'm face palming. Um, sorry, Yana. I did not intend to shoot you in the face. Okay, let's try that again with less shooting our own party members. There we go. Much more like it. Okay. Now, I think that I saw, I'm hoping it's still there and hasn't despawned, a dead animal up here somewhere. Ah, kittens, it despawned, didn't it? Yeah, I was afraid of that. Uh, might be uh, quite impressive for its day open world, but stuff does despawn. Why do you leave all your equipment behind? You could sell that. As far as I'm aware, you can't sell um, stuff in Ultima 7, or weapons at least. That, that was my impression at least. Am I mistaken in that? And if so, where can I sell that stuff? Huh. Monoliths. I wonder whether one can do anything with that. Um, hmm. All right, well, there's nothing more here, it would seem. 
So I'm annoyed that I let that. Um... Oh no, wait, it didn't despawn. I'm wrong. I'm completely mistaken. Uh, let's get a glimmer quickly so we can see what we're doing. I just walked straight past it in the dark. There we go. Oh, and there's a backpack down there too. Uh, you're not sure you think there was an armor in Britain, but honestly, it's been way too long to remember whether you could actually sell them stuff To the best of my knowledge you can't I actually did start um, Hoarding stuff when I started this run uh, Thinking that I could perhaps um, do that, but uh, as far as I'm aware you can't oh you say I'm right Yes, there you go uh, You can sell as I recall you can sell uh, gems you can sell gold and you, uh, yes, gems, gold nuggets, and gold bars. And just see what else it says here in this link that you give me. Um, so yeah, bars, gold bars, gold nuggets, gems. Oh, silver, silver serpent, venom, and mutton. Um, and that's it, unfortunately, which is a pity. It it is. Wait, bread. You can sell bread. Uh, Ah, oh. interesting. So if I go to Britain and I make bread in the bakery, I'll get five gold pieces. Uh, okay, well, maybe I could go and make some bread. Yeah, as you say, I could pick and sell, um, pick and sell eggs, but that's one gold per egg, and that's a little low right now. So I'm. Maybe I will go and make bread. Uh, five gold per bread, that might be worth my while. Um, I, get, I didn't know that you could do that one or that specific one. Um, come on, guys, let's go. There we go. Um, I usually just hunt um, for food. Yeah, but it's a win either way. You need gold and food. Yeah, I suppose so. But the main thing is um, I, as a Sort of personal rule, I don't steal anything. So without actually having, um, what's it, uh, flour of my own, it's a little difficult for me to bake bread. But if this guy pays you for making bread, then I'm okay with doing that. Um, where are we now? Okay, I'm not far off. I'm going to go, I'm going to go until I hit the uh, hit the water here and then head southwest, I think. Uh, not that water, I don't think. Uh, should hit swamp first. Uh, wait, where am I? Oh, no, no, that is the water I'm looking for. Okay, so southwest then. Over this swamp. Ah, Britain. Okay, so now I just need to find the baker. Land a magic carpet in front of his shop and... Uh, well, wait until dawn, I suppose. Um, I do have one nugget of gold that I can sell, so that's something as well. Um, and that rhymed. Uh, if I recall correctly, the baker's down here somewhere. Oh, yes, here we are. Here we go, and now, um, hmm. Wonder where we might have a. Oh, let's just have a kip on the grass here, I think. Uh, is this my. Yeah, this is my bedroll. It would be nice if the uh, backpack um, weren't affected by the light. I mean, it makes sense that it is affected, but it's not very fun, unfortunately. Okay, here we go. Whoops, don't need yellow. Right. Uh, so let's see if we can uh, make some bread. You see a very clean looking, portly young man who waves at you frantically. Uh, name? My given name is Wilhelm, although no one calls me that. I prefer to be addressed as Willie. Thank thee very much. Uh, job. I'm the baker here in Britain, and I make the sweetest bread thou hast ever tasted. 
Hast thou yet hast thou had a chance to sample any of my bread yet? I don't think so, no. Then here, yeah, thou must have some. He tears a piece of bread off one of several loaves he is carrying and stuffs it into your mouth. There! It is, is it not the sweetest bread thou hast ever tasted? It is, is it not? You chew as fast as you can in order to answer him. Uh, I'm going to presume that it is. He grabs your face by the cheeks and plants a big kiss on your forehead. Thou art truly a person of good palate and refined taste. A uh, baker? He nods. Yes, I am a baker and I have many secret recipes passed down to me by my father and mother. The secret is water and flour. Why, there are even those who say I am a master baker. And there are those who call me a donut, he says with a frown. Uh, bread. My bread is the finest in Britannia. It is renowned for both its pleasant taste and its very reasonable price. But it is a lot of work making enough to satisfy the constant demand for it. I need to hire someone to help me. Ah, this is what you're talking about, I'm guessing, Dinah. Uh, but first, secret recipes. Oh dear, do you not tell me that thou art yet another person who is trying to pry one of my secret recipes out of me. If that is what thou art after, thou art will, will ju yeah, thou wilt just be disappointed. Uh, father and mother? Willie wipes away a tear. Gone, both of them. Gone to join mine ancestors in that great kitchen in the sky. I will never be able to cook as they did. Still I plod along, trying to keep the family name alive. And that is why I am a baker. But I suppose it is not the only reason. Uh, Master Baker. Yes, many people tell me that. Now thou dost say it too. Uh, if thou dost say so, then it must be true. Well, he takes a bite of his own bread. Hmm. I am a Master Baker. A donut. He gives you a long, puzzled look. After a moment, he takes one of his loaves of bread and swats you over the head with it. Uh, what just happened? Oh, well, never mind. Um, why? Actually, there is a very good reason why I am a baker. A reason? Because the way to a woman's heart is through her stomach. Why, I have two women in love with me right now, and I did not even have to pursue either one. A uh, two women? He sighs. Ah, uh, if thou must know, their names are Jeanette and Gay. Jeanette? Jeanette is a pleasant enough girl, but to be honest, I cannot see myself with a tavern wench. She thinks I have not noticed how she feels about me. Frankly, I wish she, she would just leave me alone. Ouch. Uh, Gay? Gay, who runs the costume shop, is of more interest to me. But she is a fellowship member, and I have no wish to become one. Well, at least you have that in your favour. I, that, that, I hope that it does not prevent us from courting. We might have to go and chat with some of these people. But anyway, hire. Thou couldst work for me here in the shop making bread, where I will buy stacks of flour from thee. Thou couldst buy them wholesale in pours, and I will buy thee four gold per sack. Well, that's interesting. So we can also um, do a bit of the old um, merchant trading. We can actually go and buy flour in pours and bring it to him. Huh, interesting. Thou, dost thou wish to work here in the shop for me? Uh, sure. Excellent! Thou canst work, thou can start work immediately. I shall pay thee five gold for every five loaves of bread thou dost make. All right? Sure. First thou must make dough from the flour. Simply spread some flour on the table, add some water to make it thick, and, well, doughy. Then, then use the dough in the oven to bake it. Wait a bit, then voila! Thou dost have bread. And I think he just gave me his fa secret family recipe. Keep just one flour handy for yourself. Just keep one flour handy for yourself so you can use it to bake any time. Not a bad thought, Dino. Not a bad thought. Uh, all right. Uh, so, let's uh, have a shot at this. Uh, but there's no flour here. I might actually have to go and... Oh, no, no. There we go. And uh, water. Um... Uh, no, I missed. You don't actually need water, really. Oh. Uh, someone needs to eat. Who needs to eat? Basically all of us. 
Ah, uh, fine. Okay. Hopefully we're going to be getting some food soon. So I'm just going to feed everyone in the party and have done with it. Um... I mean, I get it with Sparks. Sparks are growing boy, but um, the rest of you, do you have tapeworms or something? Uh, okay. Not quite sure how you do... Oh, just put the white stuff in the oven. Interesting. Okay. Oh, and be careful. If you touch the baker's stuff in the oven, he will go nuts. Oh, dear. Thank you for the warning there. You can even put on the mantle. It works just as well. Okay. He has wandered off with the... Uh... He has wandered off with the uh, the flour, unfortunately. So I suppose we're going to have to go to pause soon. Uh, we made some bread. Uh, yes. Oh, okay. I have to actually have it on me. Fine, fine, fine. Just find a party member who can carry it. Oh, there we go. Okay, now we've made bread. What? Oh, fine. I have to have it in my own inventory, I'm guessing. Okay, let's try this again. Not sure if you need to sell them five at a time. Maybe, maybe. Um, well, let's just see. I'm going to put them into my inventory. See... No, it looks like you may be right. Okay. Okay, in that case, I suppose we're uh, off to pause to get some flour. Uh, oh, actually, um, before we do that, might as well just pop into the bank and sell off that uh, one gold nugget that we have. That's a start at least. Yeah, there we go. Uh, if I get around the door here, that is her desk, not the lady herself. There we go. Exchange. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Okay, now let's head off to pause. Okay. We're uh, continuing our travels with barely a pause, so to speak. Oops, and I've wandered off the, off the road. Suppose that's what I get for that pun. Excuse me if you heard me drinking there. Uh, now let's see. Navigation to pause is just due south. Um, just trying to remember whether it's this bit here or this bit here. Or, no, no, it's this bit here. That's where I want to be. Okay, so yeah, if I head just due south, I should hit the bridge. So. Must resist temptation to kill those cows for their meat. But if we do see any wild game, I am almost certainly going for it. Oh wait, hold on. This looks like it should be... This That looks like a... What's it? A mill? So... See... Yeah, this looks like the place. Yellow, how much money do we have? 42. Okay, that should be enough for somewhat. Uh, you run the mill. Um... Let's see, flour, 12 gold, uh, yep, so let me see, 12, 24, yeah, let's go for three, okay, great, so we have some flour, and I like that the mill is pretty much due south of the bakery, that's quite, that's quite convenient. So yes, and suddenly this game is turned into elite. Just 
just need to find a star base to dock at uh, and figure out quite where those uh, sacks went. Up oh, there we go. Just, uh, do this uh, a few at a time, I think. Efficiency and all of that. I, I'm trying to thank you. Ah, uh, fine. <laughs> That's right, mass production indeed, exactly. So, see how much flour we can get onto these tables. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that's about as good as that's going to get, I think. No, not 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 you, Yola. Be very nice if I could just leave them somewhere for a moment. Baker, don't you dare kill steal my bread. Of course, knowing how um, knowing how difficult it is to keep a process like this clean, you might say we're engaging in mess production. In time, the avatar will be recollecting sadly how he went from being an avatar to a freelance baking assistant. Uh, isn't that the story of Eula tomorrow? Although I don't think she recollects that sadly. I think she recollects that with a certain joy. get a cake. Maybe he did that, oh well. I'm trying not to overcook it, I'm trying. Da, 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 da. I'm thinking maybe these actually aren't valid spots. Now, I think I may have accidentally stolen that guy's cake. There we go. Alright, now we've made some bread. Yes, we have loaves for you. Ah, 12 loaves. 10 gold. Wait, what? I thought it was five gold per loaf. I could have sworn it was five gold per loaf. Wow. Okay, maybe I should just sell him the flour and have done with it. What do you mean I don't have a single one in my possession? Spark with spark. 
I, do, I have actual bags of flour. Maybe, again, maybe I need to be holding them myself. Seems he rounds down the payment. But I thought it was five gold per, um, per loaf of bread. That's what I thought the arrangement was. And I had 12 loaves. So that should be, what is that, 12 fives? That's um, 60 gold, isn't it? Oh, five gold per five bread, okay. Um, okay, so he doesn't actually take the flour from me. That's interesting. Okay, Spark, have this flower back. Yeah, so you took the 12 around and done the payment, payment to 10. You are indeed correct. I, I do wonder whether maybe we're left with two, um, the, uh, oops, two loaves. Oh, we have this fruit cake, which I think is actually his, so I'm going to put it back in there. Um, where else did I... Oops, I didn't actually want to close that. I think someone around here has um, extra loaf or two. No, maybe not. Okay, well, that's that's a thing. Um, so, Yolo, how much money do we have now? We have 16 gold. So, that's a bit of a problem. Um, oh, the selling flower thing is a bug. Lovely. Um, you know what? We've come out with less gold than we started with. I'm just going to reload. Right. Goodbye, sir. Um, okay. So given that that's not working out, I'm going to go hunting. I'm going to go, let's see. Yeah, I think I've found good hunting to the south there. So, or to the, to the west, I think that actually was. Um, so let's see what we find. Um, I also do want to try to figure out where I left that ship. It's, there's a good chance it's here in Britain, actually, now that I think about it. Uh, because I want to get, for one thing, I want to, well, for one thing, I want to see whether there's any um, any food lying around. Hello, Fox. Um, but I also want to pick up a glass sword for use against that ethereal monster that's guarding the generator. Oh, the pumpkin. It's not my pumpkin field, though. I'm not going to steal someone's someone's pumpkins. I'm an avatar of the virtues. I do not steal. At least not unless the game literally doesn't leave me a, an option, as in the case of getting through to Penumbra. So, yes, I'm not taking someone else's food. I am, however... Oops, that's the wrong button. I am, however, killing this creature. And uh, getting my five le what's it, uh, legs of meat, as is traditional with uh, Britannian deer. Also, I see Yolo's out of crossbow bolts. Um, what do we have here? He has 20 magic bolts. I'm going to leave Yolo on um, on his lightning whip for the nonce there. Um, <laughs> no, 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 no stealing. The guy pays you to pick them up if you remember correctly, but you can just you can well just keep them. Now hold on. If he's trying paying me to pick them, um, to bring them to him, and I don't bring them to him, then that's still stealing, I would say. And yes, I'm sure I could uh, pick them up. I could uh, get the money for picking them, but... Yeah, but I'm not going by the game's rules. As you say, technically, according to the game rules, it's not stealing, but it's stealing according to my rules. Um, yes, I could get the money for uh, picking them, but that means in interfacing too much with uh, with the inventory. 
Uh, I think hunting would be a little bit, a little preferable to me. Uh, someone is very hungry. Hopefully we'll find something to hunt around here. Could also use some bandits, of course, get some money because then we can just buy food. Uh, bandits or other monsters. Gremlins would be useful because they like they drop food. Um, uh, is there a bridge over this? I wonder. Oh, okay, we're coming up to pause. I don't really want to go through the swamp. But maybe I'll see if there's something there. Uh, dee -dee 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 -dee. Let's see if we have any, any animals that we can kill here. You know, that would have been a nice addition to the game. If there were um, what's it, veggies growing wild. But uh, there aren't, so we're hunting. Unsuccessfully at the moment. Tum -ti -tum -ti -tum. Someone must eat now. I wonder who that was. Everyone. Okay. Um, in that case, I'm going to head back to Britain quickly. Um... Yeah, let's head back into Britain. Let us, uh, in fact, on our, on our way, while we still have some space here, um, let's just feed our party. Okay, or most of them at least. And uh, see what else. The other option, as I've said, is finding something to fight and loot. Um, yeah. And I want to check on the... Yes, I want to check on the, the thingy, the huge other what's at the docks. Yes, to see if I left my boat here. Da, 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 da. Ah, here we go. I'm hoping that this is where I parked my boat. Ah, excellent, it is. So what do we have in the hold now? Okay, so I do want a glass sword. That's kind of important. So take one of those. Uh, is this also, yeah, it's a glass sword. What do we have in here? I think we emptied out all the food stores from here, unfortunately. Hmm, pity, 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 pity. Okay. So we have a glass sword so we can kill the, cro the monster in deceit at least. Uh, but now... Now we want to figure out what we're going to do about food. Now food and money, really, because we could also use some, uh, also use some more uh, ammunition for some of our weapons, our ranged weapons. So I'm thinking that I want to go bandit hunting, or not necessarily, or not necessarily bandit hunting. Hunting. Uh, I want to go hunt, or well, hunting for something that will drop money. Just basically bandits. Um, I'm thinking maybe I should fly down here. So let's do a save quickly. And I'm going to head south and see if I spot any bandits or monsters. Uh, you know what? There is. You're, you're thinking pirates, Dino. I've just, just occurred to me, there's a dragon cave in here somewhere that um, I haven't actually um, 
cleaned out. I'm wondering whether it's worth trying to take on the dragons. Um, which they should have some good loot. They're dragons, after all. Uh, Destard, tough fight. Yes, I don't suppose you remember where Destard is quite. I remember it was here somewhere, but I'm not quite sure where. Now, I went looking for it last time, and I didn't find it. Um, now, I don't want to go just sort of wandering back and forth again. Uh, I found the Unicorn Cave. You say it's in the... You're not sure, but it's in the bigger mountain range, you think. Okay. Uh, all right, well, let's try that. That seems like a good bet. West of Trinsic. That sounds right. Um, so, yes, let's try that. Let's uh, head, south, head uh, south for now. Head down to Trinsic and then head west and see if we can find um, a dungeon with dragons, so to speak. Uh, where are we? Uh, okay, so this should be more illicit actually. So let's, let's see if we can spot a dungeon entrance here somewhere. Here's a dungeon entrance. Where are we quite? This is a dungeon entrance west of Trinsic, so... Yes, thank you, Ceramed. There we go. Uh, so let's, uh, let's see. I'm going to... I'm actually going to put down a new... New save to be on the safe side. To be on the save side. And uh, if our light bearer here will... Oh, that's the one spent, okay. Um, let's have a candle. And let's see what we find in here. Okay, so this is the unicorn um, cave. I'm not sure whether that's... Th I don't think that's the same one is the problem. Oh, well, there's gems. Hi. Yeah. Uh, this looks like it connects at least to the dragons. But I'm not sure that it's the same actual dungeon. Let's, let's try, though. Ugh, I'm going over all these cult drops. Well, there's some headless. Maybe I'll get something out of them. to you. Oh, well, gold nuggets. I'll take gold nuggets. Um, who's yeah, you? You had some space. Uh, I'm going to just save that, I think. See, now this is a cave I want to get into. That's, that's some decent treasure. Yep, more gold nuggets. Again, that I will absolutely take. Already looted that chest. There doesn't seem to be a way through there. Hmm. Awkward. Hello, dragon. Hello, Headless. There's always more Headless. Headless are basically the Orcs of Ultima. Uh, well, you can take them this time since everyone else is... Alright. No, someone can take this. There we go. Different entrance, you guess. Looks like it is, yeah. Um, ah, there are those annoying caltrops. There we go. Let's just move those up there. Uh, 
Hello, headless. Well, I mean, look, we're getting a bunch of uh, a bunch of gold nuggets, so that's a that's a money source at least. No, there we go. No sign of an entrance there. Okay, yeah, looks like it's not here. It's it's, it's in the right place. Um, hmm. All right. Well. It's getting a bit late and I am pretty tired tonight. So, I'm going to call the stream there, I think. Um, it has been a fun stream. Um, what have we done? We've killed some animals. We've killed some headless and stolen their gold. Uh, we've baked bread. Um, we've gotten annoyed at the baker and given up on baking bread. Uh, we've played a little bit of um, Elite. Uh, Carting, what's it, uh, carting merchandise from one station to another, and uh, we've gone into the wrong dungeon. Um, so I think that's a reasonably successful. Oh yes, the lich too. Good point. We killed a, we've re-killed a lich and some skeletons, and got absolutely nothing from it. Um, yes. So I think overall that's a fairly successful. Um, oh yes, plus plus, we're not starving to death. That is an improvement. So, uh, I think that has been a fairly successful stream. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you've had fun. I very much have. So, and stay well and goodbye.